Rich Tarani with TMC here. Thanks for watching. We're at IT Expo 2014 in Las Vegas. On our program is Vishal Brown. He is with Yorktail. Vishal, welcome to the show. Thank you, Rich. So I figure we start at the top. Tell us a little bit about Yorktel and what you guys are up to. Sure. Uh, Yorktel uh, was founded about 30 years ago by York Wang. Um, we we started out in the uh, really in the telecom space and, and within the federal government and those contracts, where we grew from a AV integrator into a managed services, cloud services, and UC services provider. I know that's a mouthful, but we play in that video arena that encompasses all those functions. Um, in terms of our portfolio, um, we engage our customers around professional services where we offer consulting and guidance. Uh, managed services, like I mentioned, where we would design, build from an AV integration perspective and then manage the environment. Uh, we get into media services where we could do webcasting, streaming, live town halls. Um, we complement our managed services with staffing, so if we need to have on-site bodies to support our customers, we have some very large customers in the pharma space. We have anywhere from 20 to 30 bodies on site that would support uh, managed services uh, por or portfolio. So we, we range really from soup to nuts when it comes to video. And what are some of the newer things that you guys have been doing? Um, so where we've been seeing a lot of traction um, is really in uh, telemedicine and as well as uh, in, the, in the federal government with respect to uh, video kiosks. So what I mean by that is... Um, uh, if you look at telemedicine, for example, um, there's a lot of, there are a lot of barriers towards uh, rolling out that technology historically. Um, but with the um, evolution of you know, uh, bandwidth and remote locations, evolution of new type of video codec technologies that enable us to provide solutions that can reach these remote locations and equip telemedicine type carts and solutions to, re you know, to provide better technologies to these locations. So when we have those carts, that complements with our cloud technology or your cloud service. And we're able to provide a holistic solution that encompasses the endpoint, which is a telemedicine cart, a cloud service that provides video conferencing, uh, sorry, bridging infrastructure and port infrastructure, and then managed services on the back end to provide support and management of that entire telemedicine solution. Sounds like you have a very wide customer base then, right? I mean, from telemedicine to government, I mean, there's a lot of different kinds of customers. Yeah, I mean, we span from the, uh, in the enterprise space, a lot of Fortune 50. Uh, we also have part of the SMB market. Um, you look at federal government and public sector. Uh, the federal government is one of our big, you know, biggest, biggest customer. Um, public sector, when it comes to ho uh, hospitals, local governments, schools. So we play in each one of those markets. Great. So um, in terms of industry trends, other than when we talked about telemedicine and kiosks, what other kinds of trends are there? Have we, um, have we touched on them all or are there other ones? Um, what I would say is um, in terms of trends, the industry is moving away and we're all seeing this right in, in the video communication space. Um, they're moving away from um, hardware-based uh, endpoints uh, that traditionally set, sat in conference rooms and they're, they're going to software-based endpoints. So you're seeing that with companies like Vid.io, Video, I pronounce it Vid.io, Akano, Paxip. Um, and then when you start looking at Microsoft Link and they're moving out to Office 65, and those type of software-based technologies for video communications that either sit on a lap, that can sit on a laptop or on your mobile device as an app, um, and moving that out of the conference rooms, that's where we see the, 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 the industry is going, and it just, really helps with making video pervasive. And that kind of goes back to our previous point, which is um, telemedicine and, and, and video kiosks, because you're not stuck now with providing hardware-based endpoints within a unit. It can sit in someone's laptop and bringing together clinical staff, physicians, um, to provide remote health care to uh, patients. Great. Are there any other things we should know about your company? Um, in a few weeks, we'll be announcing two new hires for um, uh, our telemedicine uh, practice. So they've really come from great backgrounds and have been in the industry for, for, a, for a decade or more. Um, uh, that, and we're bringing that kind of experience onto Yorktel to bill out our telemedicine practice. Okay, fantastic. Well, thanks for being here. This is great. Thank you.